guys! Okay, so quick update on what's going on with my computer before I get started in my July favorites. Uh, I sent in, like, I sent in for, like, a little repair desk thing from Sony to fix my computer because I need, like, a restore desk or whatever. Uh, so I sent in for it and they sent me the wrong thing. Ooh, I was so mad when I, like, when I opened the little box thingy and it had the wrong thing in it. It didn't have a disc. It had, like, a cord and I was, like, you are kidding me. I have been waiting forever to get my computer fixed and I have some pretty bad anger issues sometimes. Like, like if something frustrates me enough, I get pretty mad. So I was throwing a little temper tantrum in the kitchen because I was like, oh, this is so not happening right now. So I, I'm filming on my phone right now because, you know, my computer's not fixed. So that's what's up with the bad quality. So I figured I'd film a July favorites. And since I can't edit from my phone, at least I don't think I can. I haven't really figured out how. So I need to quit my talking as much as I normally do and get into the favorites. So the first July favorite that I have is the CoverGirl Aqua Smoothers Foundation. And I love this foundation in general. I've been using it for a really long time. And normally I am shade 710. This, my friends, is shade 7. 40. Whenever I can graduate to a darker color, it's heaven. Literally, it's like the most exciting thing ever. I'm as white as a white person can get normally, and like it's pretty sad. I'm like super, super pale. So whenever I can get a darker shade of foundation, oh, it's, it's, it's amazing. It's pretty awesome. And then also comes with that, a darker powder. Um, this is the Fit Me, this is... Fit Me Foundation, no. This is the Fit Me Powder, and I've been using this for a while as well. And the reason I use these products is because they are not supposed to clog your pores. And I have a pretty bad acne issue, so that's what's up right here. And, and I just love this powder. I love how it looks on my skin, and I love that I have a darker color. Um, and then also my NYC Smooth Skin Bronzer in Sunny, because I'm getting darker. So... You know, that's just pretty awesome. And then next is the CoverGirl Clump Crushers. Um, mas oh. Oh. Mascara. Got caught in my hair. Um, mascara because I love this stuff. I have it in black and I have it in brown. Did you know they sell it in brown? Most people only sell mascaras in like brownish black and black and very black. But this has like a straight up brown and it's so exciting. I've always been looking for that but I could never find it. Um, so they have just like a straight up brown mascara and I love that it looks so natural and it like separates every single one of my lashes. This is just like the bomb for mascaras. Uh, okay, next is the L'Oreal Color Riche, that doesn't sound right, Color Caress maybe, uh, blushing sequins, blushing, mm -mm. blushing sequin, yeah. Uh, it looks like that, and it's just like a really pretty, like, reddish pink color, but it's sheer, so it's like really moisturizing, and it looks super nice on my lips, and it's just amazing, and it smells like the old L'Oreal juice sticks, if anybody remembers those that were like, out like a really long time ago, they don't sell them anymore, um, but it smells like those, which is like, awesome. And then, this is the Superstay 14 Hour Lipstick from Maybelline. And these things are like 10 bucks. Look at how tiny this is. $10. Whatever. But, it does smell good. And it's like, it's like a really pretty like beigey pink color. And it's like a My Lips But Better. You know what I mean? And the reason I got this <laughs> is because I have a little small girl crush on Emily Di Donato. If any of you guys know her, she's a model. She was, she's like... A spokesperson for Maybelline and she's in a few other ads and stuff and she was wearing this in one of her allure spreads that she was in so I was like okay I kind of got to get it I mean come on now so I got that and I really do like the color um, so yeah next is the China Glaze pink voltage nail polish and this is just a perfect summer fluorescent pink color and I really like it so got that and then this one you guys are probably like that's a fall color. What are you doing? But I don't stick with trends, guys. And I love this color. And every single time I would go to Ulta looking for this color, it was never there. And then the last time I went, it was there and it was the last one. And I was like, 
score getting it so yeah and it's like it looks like that but it's a little bit more purpley when you put it on and it's just so pretty it's the most gorgeous color on earth it's probably my favorite nail polish of all time and it is the opi <laughs> i didn't even tell you guys the name opi um nail polish and every month is oktoberfest gorgeous so next is my prada little tiny sampler prada candy and it smells so good i can't for the life of me describe scents so you guys might just have to go smell it all i can tell you is it smells sweet and good so Next is the Clean and Clear Body Wash, and this is the Boost Scent with Mango and Papaya. This is the only one I ever see at my Target, so this is the only one I ever buy. This is a new one because my other one just ran out. Oh, and it smells so good. It smells good. Okay, <laughs> so I use that a lot, and I really like it. And then next is my phone case. Oh my gosh, tell me this isn't the cutest thing you've ever seen. Come on, it's so cute, and then they have, like the little paw thingy right there for the little home button. Just gotta smile every time you look at it. Ah. <laughs> so that's another one of my favorites because I am in love with this case. It was twenty five bucks, but it was so worth it, and it's so protective too. It's like, it's like if you drop your phone, it's not, it's not gonna hurt your phone because that's that's a protective case right there. So, um, <laughs> thank you all for watching. This is the end of my July favorites. I hope you all enjoyed, and thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who's been subscribing to me. I can't even tell you how thankful I am. I just hit like a hundred subscribers, like over a hundred, like a few days ago, and oh, when I saw that, because you can't see your own subscribers on your phone, so when I went on to my tablet thingy that I have. It was like, I saw it and I was like, oh, there is no way. And I was just like having a little party by myself. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you guys um, so much. <laughs> I really appreciate it. And I will see you all in my next video whenever that may be. Again, sorry for the lack of videos lately. Not my fault. I promise. So uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Hope you all enjoyed. And... Adios.